Welcome back to the channel. Today I would like to guide you how to convert your JavaFX project to executable JAR file, which can be run by JVM on any device where Java is installed. I will guide you to the complete process and best practices so make JAR file easily and reduce its size also. So let's dive into it. So first here I have a simple stone paper scissors game 1 will show the preview first so you can check it's working. I have a main class which extends the JavaFX application class below instance variables are declared and then stage is set up. Below I have the main method that launch the application. Now let's close. Then I have the game controller class that contains simple logic. First I have declared fxml tag notation to some variables and then declared choices. Then initialize method that set up a image and set actions to buttons. Below a method that process user choice and random choice selected by computer. Next I have created a separate main one class to start application. It's recommended by JavaFX. It also helps to maintain. Next I have a background image and a fxml file that defines structure and look of the game. Here is background image. Now let's close and I will show you to make a executable jar file for this. File for this project. In the menu bar move to file menu item. Click below to project structure. Here first ensure project SDK Java version is selected and relevant settings are correct. Then move to the artifact section here click on the plus at top. You can see many options available we go with the first one jar select module with dependencies. Now choose the main class of your project. Then make sure to select extract to target jar. Keep the other settings as default. Now we need to add some DLL files click on plus and choose file, then go to the location. Where you have download the JavaFX SDK, move to bin folder and single click on first file and press shift and scroll down, hold the shift and click on last DLL file press ok. Now to reduce the size for jar file you can remove a DLL file name webkit scroll below and remove that. Now in next step we need to build out artifact, so move to menu bar menu item build choose built artifact choose the correct name and press on build. You can check below IntelliID is creating the jar file. You will see a new folder named out in project files soon. So expand it and right click on your jar file. Run it. So you can see it's working the application has successfully run by using the jar file. Now simply press run button. Here it show the user interface. User can select any choice and play with computer. Computer logic could be further improved to reduce the chance for player to win. But it shows a warning message. Let's close this window. If you want to remove the warning you need to set up path of JavaFX lib folder. Press on edit configuration inside VM arguments use have to use this line. Available in description. After that you need to open settings, go to appearance and UI go to path variable and create a new, click on plus icon. Set up name path to fx and location where you installed Java FX SDK location of lib folder. So after that close it and run the jar file again so you will see no warnings. To further test you can open jar file inside the file explorer right click and open with java. So the application will run in few seconds. Like the video if you found it helpful. Thank you for watching if you go any issues mentioned in comments I will provide discord link to solve your issue or any queries. Make sure to subscribe the channel and stay tuned for more upcoming content.